Police in London have launched a manhunt after of what authorities are calling a bombing on that train. At least 22 people were injured. CBS reporter Gavin Ramjan has details on the fifth terror attack in Britain this year. Terror returned to London when a homemade bomb exploded on a busy commuter train during the morning rush hour. Suddenly I heard a big bang and I turned left and I saw the fireball surge toward my side. Cell phone video from the subway car shows a white plastic bucket inside a shopping bag with what appear to be wires and a flame. Sources tell CBS News the improvised explosive device had a timer and didn't fully detonate. We uh, managed to pull ourselves away and literally jump over the fence and run down the track as fast as we can. Counter-terrorism police are scouring the scene and searching security cameras to find out who put the bomb on board. There are many urgent inquiries ongoing now with hundreds of detectives involved looking at CCTV, forensic work and speaking to witnesses. Armed police shut down part of the train line and locked down schools in this southwest London neighbourhood. Witnesses said there were children on board when the blast went off. There was an unfortunate um, little boy who smacked his head into the ground. You know, people went flying. Some passengers had minor burns and singed hair from the heat that shot through the train car. Others were hurt in the rush to escape. Hand, foot, uh, head injuries from the stampede. It's got every man for himself when that happened. Armed police remain on high alert across London until the bomb maker and any other suspects are found. Gavin Ramjorn for CBS News, London.